Hey guys, thanks for coming back. Tonight we are going to be putting up the tree. The tree is actually going to go right here where we're standing. This is the corner where we put our tree up. And as we go through putting up the tree, we're going to talk about some different decorations, some different ornaments that mean a little bit to us. Uh, and, and you can't see, but we've got uh, jasmine and cola in here. And so you'll also learn pretty quick why our tree is decorated with plastic ornaments and a lot of our precious ornaments are not put on the tree. But we look forward to discussing some of those with you. And then, and then as we go, we're going to ask a couple questions and hopefully you guys can share your, your feedback as well. All right, so we have a seven and a half foot Colorado spruce. Now, not everybody does like we do, but we went ahead and went with a fake tree. Mm -hmm. We've had this tree for three years, and it's also a pre-lit tree. So let us know. Do you guys go live tree, and, or do you go fake tree? And then if you go fake tree, do you wrap the tree with lights every year? Or do you go pre-lit? Because I'm just gonna let you know. Before this, go back. before this, we had a nine footer and we had to wrap it and we're not gonna do that again. Nope. Not gonna happen. So let's go ahead and try to get this thing set up. good sign so here's my next question then do you go with white bulbs or you go with color bulbs at your house which one is it is it the white or is it the colorful bulbs and then do you go blinking or steady um well the, actually what you just did was my favorite because it blinks between color and the color and the white because I never can make up my mind so this will be really exciting watching us hang ornaments on a tree. This is what really what brings the people to the to the channel for sure. Um, so yeah. what we're gonna do is we're gonna play this. You know what they'll really like is us arguing about who's in whose way. Or I put two red ornaments next to each uh, other, or two silver ornaments next no, no. to each other. Tell me, tell us in the comments below. Does that happen at your house as well, or is that just something that happens here at the Brown House? So what we're gonna do, we're gonna go ahead and decorate this thing, but we're gonna do it in hyper speed. So we'll be back with you in just a minute to talk about ornaments. So these are some of our special ornaments here. Uh, Connie made these for us, but they've got family member pictures in them. And then we come down here and we've got a pre-married Haley and Zach there. And we come over here and we've got Cola. We've got BB. We've got Zach and Haley's wedding picture. Let's see if I can find them all. We've got uh, Gatto. Gatto's no longer with us, but we still have an ornament for Gatto on here. We've got the, the big girls. There's Moose and Charity and Jamie. They're all gone. They're all gone, but we still have the ornament for them. We don't have an ornament yet for, for uh, Jasmine, but that's in the works. We'll get one for her as well. And then... Uh, oh. Oh, we've got another important one there. Haley loves this picture every time we show it. Cute little Haley there. Married Haley there. We'll go back one more time. And then another important ornament to me. Brayden made this one for me a little while back, a couple of years ago. Last Christmas, I think it was. But it's got a school picture in there. 
and he handmade that for me. So that means a lot to me as well. That one's really important to me. All right, so we've got the tree up, we got the lights going, we got ornaments on it. Uh, we'll get a good look at that here in a second, but we wanted to talk a little bit about some of our special ornaments. And Shell's got a couple special ornaments, some special decorations, and some things like that. So what do you got first? Um, these are really special to me. Um, really good friend of mine um, made these for me for Christmas, I don't it's know, a couple of years ago. It's the wonderful time of the year in glory to the newborn king. So I love these. And that same friend made me this last year. No. Merry Christmas with Christ in huge letters. I love that. So, yeah, that I really beautiful. love this. So, what anyway. Is, what is that friend's name? Let's give her a shout out. Miss Angie. Miss Angie. Thank you, Miss Angie. We love you, Angie. Okay. Oh, Mike, you have something here you wanted to talk about. Yes. So, I'm going to show an ornament. This ornament is probably older than I am. This actually, my, my Grandma Pearl, my dad's mom, uh, actually, these ornaments were from from her, so these are several several years old. I'm old, so I know that these are old because these are as old as I can remember. Um, now these, I do know that my grandma Lucille made these because she liked to do a lot of sewing with um, plastic canvas. Um, so I have actually a bunch of these ornaments that oh, they just keep coming don't they, they just keep coming but yeah i have a lot of these um that she made um so i hang on to those oh, it's actually a pin it's a pin it's a it goes like you know on a shirt um i've had this since i was a little girl um i used to wear it on my winter coat how fun and yeah i loved this cool. thing and so i've kept him around um, this one was special. Again, it's kind of, <laughs> they're kind of tangled up in here, but this is a ceramic cat. Um, I used to really have this thing about cat figurines and anything that had cats I used to collect. And I had a friend um, that I used to work with who gave this to me one year. Um, and she passed away a few years ago. Um, but this ornament has always been really special to me. Um, now these ornaments are even older. Most, um, and my parents will recognize these. These things are older than me. And I'll just go ahead and tell you I'm 51 years old. You don't look it. I was thinking 27. <laughs> Am I right, folks? 27? Um, so yes, these are older than me and they are very fragile. Um, but just, <laughs> as you say fragile, she doesn't, isn't that how it usually works out? That's, oh my. That's usually how it goes. Yeah. Um, even the hooks on them are like the original hooks. I've never changed them out. So, um, but my parents, I mean, I remember these growing up. They always went on our, on our tree and I love the colors. They're bold. Uh -huh. They're very pretty. Colors. I love them. I really wish, you know, that I was able to actually hang them up and display them. We would love for you guys to share pictures of your uh, sentimental ornaments, some of those that mean the most to you guys for sure. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. As you can tell, we got the tree up and decorated, lit up. Uh, please leave some comments down below. Uh, do you prefer fake trees like we do, or do you go live trees? Uh, blue and colorful lights, or do you go white lights blinking or solid just let us know uh, what your tree looks like you know what what the heck just post a picture of your tree in the comments i would love to see it and all right thank you guys for watching merry, merry christmas, christmas.